In this video, I'll be showing you step by step how to create a banner for your YouTube channel using Canva. I'll also be sharing with you very creative ways by which you can use your channel banner to get more subscribers and even sell on your channel. If this is what you're looking for, then let's go. And welcome my name is Tokwe Aomashe if you're new here and you want to learn how to grow your YouTube channel how to use YouTube to grow your personal brand or business or generally learn stuff about YouTube you are in the right place and I want you to start now by subscribing and clicking on that bell so you don't miss anything let's get right into the topic now here is my channel and you can see at the top of my channel a beautiful YouTube banner. YouTube calls this your channel art. And what you can see first off is that it's beautifully designed and it makes the channel just look so professional, okay? Now, I created this channel banner from scratch using Canva and I'll be walking you through how I did this and other ways by which you can create yours. If you don't want to create from scratch, there are hundreds of templates in Canva you can use and I will give you a design template that will guide the elements in your channel and make everything fall in place when you upload it so what's the big deal about paying attention to your channel banner number one it's the main graphic element on your channel and it goes a long way to brand your channel and give people an idea what you're doing on your channel if done right it helps attract your tribe to your channel and also gets you more subscribers towards the end of this video I'll be sharing with you a pro tip that would help you even use your channel banner to get more sales in your business so you definitely want to stick around to the end now let's go to YouTube to see what they have to say about your channel banner on my channel you can see at the top right corner here there's a camera icon that I can click on to help me change my channel banner. When you click on that, this is what pops up and you can select a photo from your computer. By clicking on how to create channel art right here, we can learn more about your channel art. Okay, so here YouTube gives us details on how to change your channel art, which I'll be showing you along the line. But what I want to show you is how your channel art appears across different devices, okay? I'm gonna click on the TV display and here it shows like a background picture when people check your channel from their TV, their smart TVs. Now on the computer, your channel art looks slim and long and on mobile devices, this is what it looks like, very cropped. You don't need to get overwhelmed by all the dimensions of your channel banner because the template I'm giving you is gonna help you solve all that problem. So now let me take you to Canva and show you how to create your banner from scratch. If you have never used Canva before, there's a link in the description below that will lead you to the website and you can create a free account and just get going with your design. What you want to do is just go to your browser and type in www.canva.com and click on that and then it takes you to the Canva website. I already have an account with Canva, so I'll just log right in. But if you don't have an account, you want to come here and sign up with either your email or your Facebook. So now we are in and this is how we get started. You come to the search bar and type in YouTube channel art. That's it. So there's a lot of templates on Canva that you can use to create your banner without necessarily creating from scratch. And I'll show you how to use one of them. This, for instance, is an amazing template for a makeup artist. All you need to just do is come here and change the name. Turquoise Makeup Place. Yeah. You can adjust your text size by coming up here. You can change your text font by coming here and picking any of the available fonts. I'll just choose this. You can change the colors. From this peach, click on the color box here and select whatever color you like. So I want to change mine to red. And yes, probably change this to red as well. Okay, change my font to white. 
I mean, basically you can do whatever you like. You can even change the color of your background to anything else that you like. So maybe gray or something, and then you're done. By default, this design has been created to fit into your channel banner perfectly. Okay, and what I want you to know is the dimensions of a channel banner. Here I have my template that I talked about right here. And if I would enlarge this, you can see the different dimensions on this template. The entire full view is visible on TV. And then this end to this end, this slim area is visible on a full size desktop. The next section is visible on tablet. You can see right here, it's visible on tablet alongside everything in the middle. The smallest device is always the mobile phone, right? And that is what shows in the safe area. What this basically means is that anything you put in the safe area shows on all your devices, mobile, tab, desktop and TV, right? So when you're designing, you want to arrange everything to fall in place. Now I'm going to switch this around and turn this into the background temporarily so you can see. Now to upload the template you're going to be getting from me, you come to this green bar here and click upload an image or video. Click on that, click on this folder that says device and go to your computer to select the template, right? So I have the template here already. Now I want to temporarily change the background of this design to my template and see how everything in the design falls in place. So I'm going to drag my template into the design. And what you can see right here is Topper's makeup place, tried and trusted, falls in the safe area alongside a part of the other designs. So what this basically means is that when I upload this on YouTube, it's going to show beautifully. Now for those who like to create from scratch like me, I want to show you how to use a very plain background. Now, if you are getting value so far from this video, I want you to hit that like button and let me know. I want you to know that on this channel, I create weekly videos that will help you stop dabbling and start dominating on YouTube. So feel free to drop me a comment below and let me know the kind of videos you would like to be seeing on this channel. Let's move on. So we're going back to the home page on the top left corner here and see home. On the home page, you just come back to the search bar and type in your YouTube channel art. And so for those that prefer to create from scratch, here is where you start from, the blank page. This is your canvas to create whatever you desire from scratch. I'm going to show you how to use this blank page from where I created my own design. So I'm going back to home to select my own design right here. So here is where I started testing out different things on a plain template and trying to see what works for me right? I have different renderings of this design and eventually I decided to use this one. So this is the full design and if you were to see this on a TV, you'll be seeing the entire design. Now, if I dropped my template on this design, you would see again that everything falls in place. All my text fell in the safe area and you know, that's why it's rendered beautifully well on my channel. So now I'll give you a rough idea how to create from scratch. Now you don't need to have a very busy banner like mine. You need to just focus on these four things. Number one, what your channel is all about. In one line, you want to tell people visiting your channel what your channel is all about so they can subscribe. Number two, you want to include your posting schedule. Do you post every week? Do you post every Tuesdays and Thursdays? Just to let your visitors know that you take your channel seriously and you are always creating valuable content for them. Number three, you want to include your face. Of course, it's your channel. Now, number four, you want to consider your brand colors, okay? It's absolutely important that by the time you're creating your channel, you have an idea what colors you want to be using on your channel. You want to create some branding consistency, right? And that's all you need. Now, let's get to trying to create from scratch. On this plain page, I want to show you a few ways you can create from scratch 
using the template that you're going to be downloading in the description below. Now, the first thing you want to do is probably add your picture. Now, one thing I like to do with my pictures is remove the background. Now, if you don't have the paid plan on Canva, you can't get this effect, but it's fine. You can do this outside of Canva by going to remove dot bg now here you will see upload image upload the image you want to edit and then you're done click on this button to download and then you can take this picture upload on canva and put it on your design but now because i have the effect i'm going to use the effect on canva so what you do is go to this effect button right here on the left bar click on background remover and this is absolutely beautiful. So what I want to do next is add text. I come to the left tab here and click on text, click on heading and say something, right? I can change the size. I can make it into two lines, move it around. And then you can come to the left tab here and select elements you can play with, okay? So here you have elements. Scroll down and see you have uh, shapes, you have frames, you have stickers, okay? And um, I personally love to add gradients to my designs. So I select gradients. And here are beautiful gradients I can add. So I can use this. And then it falls behind my text, makes it look really nice. Uh, it has three colors and then you can see the colors right up here. I can change them to all look like gold, change the shades to make it look golden. So what else? I can add a, another text, like a subtitle, new videos every week. What else do I want to add? I probably want to change the entire background from white to maybe gray. You can use a background, there's background here. Click on it and select any background of your choice. If I select this, the background changes. So this is how it works. You don't need to make your banner so busy. Basically, just play around. One element I also like using is the frames. Right here, frames. I can add this frame to my design and drop a picture inside. So I'll take this picture again and put it in the frame, drag and drop it in the frame. Adjust it and make it look really nice. Reduce the size of the frame. I can even delete this one and put the frame here just to make things look a little nice. So basically you can play around and just test out what you like, what you don't like. So what I want to confirm now is if everything I've created here falls in the design template that I'm talking about. So I'm going to go to my uploads again. Another way to apply the template to your design is by just clicking on it and don't drag and drop it. And you can come to this place here where the word position and bring it either backwards behind the other designs or forwards. So now it's on top of everything, it's forward. Now you can move it to cover your design by just pulling on the edges. And then how do you see your design to know if it fits into the template? You come to this area here on top here and click on transparency. You can increase transparency, maybe 50% or something. And then you can see below the template that all my text and my picture and all of that falls in the right place. So that's very important. And when you are done with the template, just click on it and delete. And I'm back to my design. So I want to basically export this design I created from scratch by going to download. The file type should be PNG. I'll go straight to the page I want to download. Downloading page 22. And I click on download. I've also downloaded the first one I created. So we can go to YouTube now to try both of them out. We'll come right here to change the banner. First, I'll use the one I created from a template. 
Now what you see here is that it fits perfectly into all the designs. It fits perfectly into the desktop, the TV, and the mobile. So let's just select. Here we go. Now I want to try the one I created from scratch as well. Beautiful, it's intact. So you click on select and that's it. We have a beautiful channel banner. Now remember that this was created in a hurry. You want to take your time and create something really, really nice. So to the pro tip I mentioned, now you want to pay attention if you're an entrepreneur, a business owner, and you have businesses outside of YouTube that you want to drive traffic to. You want to pay attention to this pro tip. It's going to help you a whole lot. Now back to the Canva design. I'll take you straight to my existing design and show you a few things. So this is an example of a plain design. But to my current design, what you can see here at the extreme right here is an extra graphic element. And what this does is basically to drive traffic to my website. Whatever website you desire, whether it's your ebook landing page, your web store, your free masterclass, whatever it is, this is a graphic element that lets people pay attention to your website link. Now I'll show you where the link is on YouTube. So right here you can see I have a free channel checklist and there's an arrow that points to the website. I'm going to click on my own link now to show you what my own website looks like and this is just a website where you can download my free checklist. By the way, if you want to grow your YouTube channel, this is the checklist for you. So now you have my pro tip and you can go ahead and create a fabulous channel banner. Remember to get the template in the description below. If you are yet to watch my YouTube setup tutorial where I showed step by step how to create a very powerful YouTube channel and all the settings you need to optimize your channel, you want to click on the card right here and get into that video. It's going to help you power up your channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video and until then, keep showing up and keep crushing it.